Hey, my name is Michael, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the Apple TV UI kit that you can get from applypixels.com. Some of the highlights of this template is that it includes most standard TV OS interface elements in editable vectors. You can drag assets from the assets palette into artboards for quick prototyping, and it includes both dark and light variants of most interface elements. What you need is this folder downloaded from applypixels.com, which holds the template itself and a readme file and a version of Photoshop CC 15 or later. So we need our board support. Let's go right ahead and open up the template file. This is a pretty big PSD file, but essentially it consists of some metadata that you don't really need and all of the different assets that you see here, which is kind of all the standard elements in the tvOS interface to date. And then there's a 1080p artboard, which you can use to build out your interface. Let me just show you how this works. Let's just briefly take a look at some of the assets that come bundled with this template. First of all, you'll notice that there's both a dark UI and a light UI. If we open up that folder, you'll see various assets. And if we change the background up and we hide the dark UI and enable the light UI, you'll see the light variants of those same assets. Now let me show you how you can use those assets to really quickly prototype Apple TV screens. Let's build a light UI. We'll find our screen one artboard. Just change the background here to extra light. And let's imagine we wanted to have a tap bar in the screen. Pretty common element. You can either right click and duplicate this group or you can hold down option and just drag it down here into the artboard. And if I hit Command T, you'll notice that I simply now have this asset that just drags into my artboard. We'll place that there, for example. Now let's use the grid system to get some content in. Let's choose a one, a three, and a five column grid. We'll do the same. We'll copy it into our artboard there. Hit Command T, place them. And now we've already started putting together the mockups for this Apple TV app. And you can quite quickly build this out by copying the artboard, duplicating it, for example. Now we have a secondary screen, we call that screen two. And we can continue to copy down assets from the assets library, creating and building out all these various screens that our would-be app consists of. And obviously you can go ahead and you can customize these assets. They're all vector-based and it's quite easy to change colors or anything else that you want to do. They're simply there to give you a good foundation when you start to put together and customize your UI. And that's how you use the Apple TV UI kit that you can get by becoming a subscribing member at applypixels.com. I really hope this template helps you create fantastic Apple TV interfaces. Thanks for watching.